Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Abercrombie try on haul styling video. Alright you guys, I got so many cute pieces, so much color, so many just fun pieces I'm super excited to share with you today. Like always, everything I mentioned will be linked down below for you guys, all the outfits, anything that I actually pair picked from the Abercrombie website We'll have sizing next to it as well as my measurements just for comparison if you're curious to check out any pieces. Also any of the additional pieces that I use to style um, like throughout my closet, shoes, accessories, all that good stuff will also be linked down below. So let's jump in. I'm super excited. This first piece is a little bodysuit and y'all I wanted to love this but honestly it's weird because normally Abercrombie bodysuits are like awesome like see-through or like not see not see-through and just thicker higher quality than this one and I wanted this one to be if they have this in black I'm going to get it because it is a gorgeous fit it's just to see-through and I would say you could size up in this um just as reference so this is a beautiful like square neck at the um, top I love that the straps are wide I just feel like that angle looks really good um, it's just see-through and a little bit low. The back is stunning. It has this like twisted, not detail. It is a ribbed material. It's weird because the back is double lined. Like why is the front not double lined? It makes zero sense to me. I'm like, is that, was that an accident? There is no way that this is meant to be the front. So, uh, cause it's, cause it's a thong bottom and <laughs> that would be weird. Um, but yeah, I just don't know why the front is not double lined. If it was, it would be an absolute perfect fit. Um, but yeah, I, I really liked it. I love the color. It's just too see-through for me, but overall such a cute piece. And if you can snag it in black or any darker color, you'd be good to go. And you could go up a size if you were concerned about like the lowness, the low cut. You guys know I am a graphic queen, a graphic tee queen. I love them. I feel like, I don't know, Abercrombie just does them so well. They're so soft. They're so buttery. They're so like the perfect amount of like that vintagey look without, I don't know. I, I just absolutely love them. So I got this one, it says Def, Def Leopard on it. I specifically like the color, it's yellow. I'm really into yellow this spring and summer. So I grabbed this, it is very oversized. I got it in a small. Um, I do find that their tees do shrink up a little bit. You could go down a size if you do not want it this oversized, but it's just the perfect like effortless look and I absolutely love it. And I love this color. I think that's more what I'm going for with these tees. I know some people are like, why would you wear a band tee that you don't even listen to? It's literally just, it's fashion, sorry. That's what I like it for. And I love, 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 love that color and the feel and everything about Abercrombie's graphic tees are such high quality. I'm obsessed. Okay, this is a piece that I've been wanting in my wardrobe, wanting to invest in my wardrobe. I have a couple of really fun, like, patterned or textured blazers, but I do not just have, like, a plain navy blazer. I actually do, but it is so old and it just, like, doesn't fit me the correct way anymore. I honestly need to pass it along, but this guy, okay. I wanted to wear this in a casual way, but you obviously can dress it up as well. I love this navy blue. It is such... A nice quality blazer it is like satin lined inside I got it in an extra small because I read the reviews saying that it ran large so I wanted to make sure that it wasn't too large because I still wanted that fitted blazer look because I like to wear more like baggier items underneath it so yeah and I love pairing blazers with shorts I know it's not everyone's cup of tea but it is mine the gold button detailing is so Stunning. You can actually close this if you wanted to. Um, I chose not to. The pockets are real. You just have to like unhook the stitching. It's beautiful. It does not have like the um, like slit in the back, but it's not like super long where I feel like you need it. This is so cute. I am so happy to have that in my wardrobe. It's just, I feel like you can never go wrong with blazers and blazers are really in y'all. I used to wear blazers all the time in college, like all the time. And I'm happy that they're finally coming back in. I think they're just such a sophisticated look and I love it. Okay, 
I grabbed a bunch of different dresses and I actually have a wedding to go to not until September but I am a plan ahead when it comes to like um dresses just because I feel like I I don't know I feel like I'll, when it comes to the last minute I never find something I like so I always like to try out Abercrombie's dress section and if I like it cool I keep it and then just wait for an event to come but this one was so fitting and flattering and honestly I love this green color but I think they have it in a light blue and I think the light blue would be better for this wedding just because it's in September but in September in Texas it's still like super freaking hot um but this material is really nice it's like thick I don't even know how to explain this material honestly I'm sure it's like polyester but yeah polyester and elastane it's very thick and almost like spongy but in a good way okay super form fitting fits the body perfectly i absolutely love that i love the necktie detail it has a zipper to get in and out of these straps are completely adjustable and they are finished off and it looks i mean the quality is so freaking nice you guys i honestly love this dress i love this color i just feel like i already actually own a color dress like this it's patterned but i already own something like this and i feel like for like a I know technically September is like fall-ish. It's not fall in Dallas. Um, so and we're coming back to Dallas for this wedding. So I figured the light blue might be pretty, but it is such a beautiful dress. The slit is nice. This isn't a dress that you really could dress down. Like you're only dressing this up, um, but it's everything about it. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'll be in love with it. Okay, this is another contender. So. What I've learned with Abercrombie dresses is I'm only like 5'5", five, five, maybe 5'6", five, but I have longer legs. So I always get size or length tall. So I get my true to size and then I get tall length just because I don't want my booty cheeks hanging out. If you do, that's you, you do you, I'm, I'm cool with it. But for me, I like a longer length. So for this guy, this had terrible reviews. Uh, but I actually think it's really pretty. Okay, so hear me out. First of all, you could go up a size if you were in between sizes because I did notice it was a little bit tight on my back. So yeah, either way. I got a small, so I could have gone to a medium. If you're in between sizes, I would size up. This neckline is so flattering. I feel like on a chest without a bra, because you wouldn't wear a bra with this, it's just like holds, lifts, separates, it just does it all. It's so cute. I love the fact that there is a tie in the back. It makes sure that the shoulder straps stay up. It's so cute. Love that it cinches in at the waist. And I love this like tiered um, skirt. It is super fluffy, but it is tight at the waist. I feel like it's adorable. It's such a pretty like spring um, or summer wedding dress. If, if it's like a not formal setting if that makes sense because it's not a it's not a very formal dress I would say it's more cocktail sort of you could even wear this to like a party or something it is double lined um it is stunning the only thing I will say is I'm not obsessed with the pattern but I find that just I like will fixate on the actual pattern itself but once it's on and it's like styled I'm never like oh I don't like that pattern I don't know it's basically just like watercolored pastel floral situation um but once it's on and i feel like you accessorize with the right stuff you don't really notice that it's like that i don't know anywho i love that dress so cute super flattering i would say size up if you're in between sizes but overall actually i would just go true to size because i feel like this might be too loose so and you can't not address the you cannot adjust the straps so i know about bad reviews i saw but i didn't read the reviews i'm assuming it might be length because it is pretty short even with the tall so keep that in mind this dress same thing is a ruffly beautiful super cute this also got terrible reviews and i do not understand why super deep v in the front and in the back i love these ruffle sleeves i would say the top is a tiny bit big um, like in the breast area so I guess maybe that could be a complaint so there is elastic on it you could do like breast or like um what do I want to say like tape tape it so it doesn't go anywhere um you cannot wear a bra with this you could wear like pasties or whatever but you don't need to because it is um 
pretty like double lined in the breast so I didn't notice any issues it is so pretty I love this tiered sort of baby doll top there is a zipper and a clasp to get into the back it is not double lined and it is sheer if you like don't wear nude undergarments I'm, I'm you're not gonna see anything with nude undergarments um because when I put it on I was like oh this isn't double lined but then I like I was wearing nude undergarments so then I like stuck something that was colorful underneath it and I was like you could definitely see but it's not form fitting so it's not clinging to anything. It's super freaking cute. I am like, I feel like you could dress this up, you could dress this casual, um, I don't know, I really freaking like it. Sound off in the comments down below, what do you guys think of it? Um, like I said, the strap area is a little bit big so I could see that being an issue for some people but overall it's so cute I think it's the perfect white summer um, baby doll dress I love that baby doll dresses are coming back in they're just super flattering and in like forgiving to like you know food babies and stuff so I'm a fan I think those are all of the dresses that I got I have been in love with two-piece sets this is actually part of a two-piece set as well I like to mix and match them I love to wear them as their their own I like to put bodysuits under them I like to top swimsuits with them I just think they are such an effortless easy way to just put together an outfit okay this is such a nice one this is such a nice linen fabric I have so many like plain I actually don't I got rid of a lot of mine because they get dingy after a while I wanted to say I had a lot I think I have one so but this is a different material it's like really really linen -y. let me see it's 55% linen and 45% viscose viscose whatever um, it is double lined in the like shoulder areas um, but this is like high quality it's thick like yeah it's thick but it's so pretty this over swimsuits this by itself so cute and it came with matching six inch shorts and honestly at first I was like these are too long these are very like trouser looking sort of things but I figured it'd be the cutest um like set to wear over the top of a bathing suit if you're going on a vacation like beach or something like that I feel like this would be perfect the only thing I will say is mine has a little mark in it so I am going to exchange it I don't know what this pink thing is I don't know how it happened but it's kind of a bummer and I don't really want a white or my like white shorts have a big pink mark on them already true to size they are a little tight but they do have the bungee in the back um, front is just a plain um, like trouser look with some pleating these are long but they are so cute I think they are like a full white set like that is super sophisticated like I said you can wear it on its own you can wear it over the top of bathing suits a bodysuit whatever options are endless and I absolutely love it the shorts are double lined they have like a a um, just cotton liner inside as well and they are like a heavy thicker material but like really good quality in a good way not in like a oh this is thick like a good thick so a good thick you know and to go with that little set my vision was to put this super cute little checkered swimsuit I love this for their high-waisted bottoms can we just actually have a moment for Abercrombie doing curve love and larger sizes for their swimsuits because I was like how is that like how are people doing that because I am like borderline medium large in the top like and I don't even have that big of boobs so I'm like how is that like gonna fit anybody okay so I'm really happy they've extended their sizing in swimsuit that's super exciting this print is gorgeous it's like textured um I got the I get their high-waisted bottoms in a small but I get their low rise in like a medium um, because I just find they dig into my ups a little bit but these this is so cute I love the pattern the top I got in a medium and I honestly need a large this cup size is just not enough coverage and it can tend to like roll if that makes sense so you have to be like cautious of that um there is a definite top to and a bottom the top is like a seamless sort of thing and then the bottom has a little bit more to hold it up super cute top it reminds me very like flintstone vibes i don't know why but i absolutely love this and with that linen set it was precious i'm obsessed i have been wanting just a plain sort of i think this is called a poplin tiered skirt whatever i used to have one of these a while ago and i just feel like skirts kind of weren't really big or like more like satin longer maxi skirts were but these sort of like not mini skirts but like 
I don't know, I call them baby doll skirts as well. I absolutely love this. I feel like you can pair it so many different ways. Um, with a swimsuit, you can pair it with um, a button down like this. Ooh, that would be cute. A graphic tee, sneakers, sandals, everything. It's so cute. You cannot go wrong with this. The quality is amazing. It is like double lined. Yes, it is double lined. It doesn't have pockets, that's my only complaint, but honestly, I feel like pockets would be bulky, so love this. Fits true to size, so freaking cute. Definitely a staple in my wardrobe. So happy to have it. I grabbed two pairs of jeans. These ones were pretty much an epic fail for me. Okay, like I feel like this is the tiniest 25 inch waist that I've ever experienced in my entire life. I got a 25 because they were curve love and I feel like the curve love tends to be a little bit bigger. Not the case with these. These are their ankle straight ultra high rise curve love. Okay. They didn't work for me. I do love, and one thing I will appreciate and call out is Abercrombie puts like a full lining under the white pants, which is so awesome. So you can't see any of your undergarments in the front. Um, like their pocket extends longer, but if they're too tight, you can still see it. So that was my issue with these. I would need these in a 26, but unfortunately they're sold out. I was grasping at straws getting the 25, um, and it didn't work out for me, but these are super cute. I love their white denim. It's soft. It's comfortable. I love the distressing. It's the perfect amount of like chic, cute, whatever. Super cute. Just too too small for me unfortunately so I'll see I'll keep my eye out and see if they have a um, larger size and if they do I'm scooping up why does Abercrombie still not have the notify me when available like please I wish they did because it would make shopping so much easier anyways um, I have a plain pair of white denim but I don't have any distress so that's why I wanted that for a more casual look I grabbed these dad jeans or no these aren't the dad jeans why did I think these were dad jeans these are the 90s straight ultra high rise but they have that little crisscross in the front I love this detail I think it is so pretty with a bodysuit with a graphic tee anything I just love that the length on these is perfect they are a 26 regular I think I am a true 26 I go between a 25 and a 26, but I just feel the most comfortable in the 26. They are the perfect medium wash. The length is awesome with a pair of high top Converse's. They're super cute. They're just a straight leg and I absolutely love the fit of those jeans. I'm a bum, everything, it's A1. All right, I grabbed another bodysuit. This one's super cute because it's, I think it's called their elevated <laughs> sweater bodysuit or something like that. I love the piping details. I love the thick straps. You could wear a bra with this. I did not, but you could. Um, I love this purple color. It is so freaking stunning. The only thing, I only styled it one way, I think, which I really wish I would have styled it with ripped denim and a pair of nude heels because that would be a super cute, like, going out outfit, but it is so high quality. It's super cute, and this color was, was everything to me. I love the, like, purpley pink tone and then last but not least I got this oversized um little like button up thing I got this in a small you need to at least size down one or two sizes it is so big like it's short sleeve but the short sleeves still come to my elbow which is just a bit too big for me it's still super cute I love it but I would go with a smaller size really awesome quality very thin love this color blocking or like different texture with the stripes and the salad I think it's so cute um, like tied around the waist or like tied in a knot at the waist with a pair of shorts is super cute um, or with those white denim is what I was thinking but obviously the white denim have to go for me so those are all of the pieces that I picked up at Abercrombie I think this is one of my favorite hauls that I've done in a hot minute I just love all the bright springy colors and I'm super excited to be moving somewhere where I can actually like dress like for the season versus it just it's already 100 degrees outside in Dallas so I'm super excited um, for all these new pieces so like I said everything is linked down below if you guys are curious to check anything out all my sizing and all that good stuff for reference if you guys need it and yeah if you like seeing these type of videos let me know by giving this video a big thumbs up let me know if you're going to pick anything up down below in the comments and I'll talk to y'all in my next video bye